Wow, it's been a while since I've done one of these, huh? At first, I like to say that I was working on this a while ago, as in a few months ago, but the footage got corrupt and I moved to a new device, etc. But anyways, we're going to be doing TC2 skins this time. And before we begin, as per usual, disclaimer. Stereotypes aren't meant to be taken seriously, they're purely meant to poke fun at common conceptions people have made over the years. So are we good? We good? Alright, let's begin. Ah yes, the only female mercenary of the bunch. People who wear this gun can range from casual players randomly unboxing her to full on tryhards. In terms of skill, these people aren't the best, but definitely not bad. Or when did I mention a lot of people sim for age? Most of the time you see anyone wear this, there's a good chance that they will A, annoy the hell out of you, B, miss half of their shots, and C, wear this skin because it looks like delinquent. Normal flankers, however, aren't anything to worry about, but if you see a flanker that's cool, expect nothing but sweat. Seriously, I will give anyone five bucks if you can find a flanker that's cool that isn't sweaty. These guys really like to surprise you. Seriously, if I had a nickel for every time I've been killed by an annihilator, being in the weirdest spots possible, I'd be a gazillionaire. They're crazy, seriously. Jerk is nobody uses a skin. <laughs> And just aside, you rarely ever see anyone using arsonists besides, well, myself, of course. And most of the time, they just really aren't that great. They kind of just exist. Now, although Marksman is a precision-based class in TC2, these guys tend to be really clueless about their surroundings. Even good ones seem to not notice small and simple things. But regardless, these people are, for the most part, good, so just keep that in mind next time you find one. Now besides being Chase Rooney's favorite skin, most Brute users are very chill to play with. Seeing a really good one is rare, but they'll always give you a challenge when the time is right. Now, if you see a Rider Brute, however, take everything I previously said and throw it out the window. These guys are very good at the game and will be a consistent threat, regardless of the mode. These guys are also very chill, but just very sweaty. So take it with a grain of salt. Some of the most aggressive players I've ever seen. They will usually overextend it to kill a player, and because they most of the time have the aim to back up overextending, it actually works. And if you see a mechanic with an unusual, you might as well not bother trying to push them, because 9 times out of 10, they're already pre-aimed where you're coming from. Now you won't see doctors much, but when you do, you know you can count on them. They're overall team players and they seem to be there when you most need them. Seriously, I love these guys. These guys just suck at shooting projectiles. That's it. And that's about it. Now, before I sign off, I'd like to just say thank you to a few of my friends who recorded some audio for this video. They want to be in it, so why not? Let me know what category of skin you'd like to see for the next part whenever I actually make it. <laughs> and until next time, peace.